Surrey Pretrial is a medium-sized center that currently is moving to becoming one of the largest centers in the province. We house a variety of different inmates from high risk to low risk. Uh, lots of opportunities for people to look at occupations and their possible career. The Records Administration Department is an extremely busy area. Uh, you have to be able to multitask, work quickly, and also understand the technical side of it, and then be able to react to uh, stressful situations that could happen in the holding cells. You have to be able to think on your feet and uh, have a high skill level. There's approximately 24 inmates on the work program. We call the maintenance work program. We do woodwork, we do repairing televisions, we repair microwaves, we do the cleaners, which the floor guys, the maintenance workers, painters. We make clothes here for the inmates, i.e. The, the, uh, the reds. Some of these guys come in my program and have no skills whatsoever. They get to work around people who have skills, we pass it on to them. The uh, perception that I had was very misleading. I, I was told that uh, the inmates don't talk to you, you don't talk to them. That is not true. It's not just a segregated inmate guard type atmosphere. When this program started a few years ago, it was a very small, it was a very small unit. So we've, we've now expanded it and we're hoping to expand it more because we'd like to get more inmates off the units to give them skills. And they enjoy coming down here because they want to keep busy. Uh, they want to learn new things and they learn new things every single day. Uh, teamwork is paramount working in corrections, not only to make the job a, a better environment, but we're, we're relying on each other for safety. We're, we do work with dangerous offenders in this institution, so we have to be aware of our, of our, uh, our surroundings. We have to have really good communication skills. And then throw on top of that, we have to have a bit of empathy. Not everybody has those skills. You, you, you have to be a special person to be able to do this job and do it successfully. Uh, it's not a one-man show here. You have to pull your weight. It's like a bunch of people on a boat. We all have to row. We all have to do what we have to do to uh, accomplish our goal. With the new technology that's coming in, it's going to demand more technical skills from, for, from a correctional officer, which will open up the doors and avenues for, for people coming in that have those skills. Multitasking, being uh, technically effective and knowing how to, how to operate uh, systems is going to be really, really important. For someone that has those skills, it, it's, it's an ideal situation to come into that you could only get from working in, in uh, corrections.